I just finished this prototype for my A-frame rabbit tractor. Um, the tractor is, by that I mean that it, not that it's self-propelled, but that you can pull it along the ground, and about every day or twice a day you can move it to a new spot of grass. Um, this, the cage area is six feet long. The doghouse, or rabbit house, if you will, on the far end is about two feet wide. The whole cage is three feet wide. This end is made in pieces. I can take this part off of the middle with screws so that I can gain access to the cage if I absolutely need to. Under normal circumstances, I would never need to get into the wire cage. The total cost for this project in materials is somewhere in the neighborhood of $60, depending on exactly how you source your materials and I used one sheet of OSB. On the next version, I'll use exterior grade plywood. On this one, I used half inch or 7 16 OSB. On the next one, I'll use either quarter inch or 3 8 inch exterior grade plywood. Um, the inside of it here, let me see if I can get closer and brighten this up a little. Um, the bottom of the cage on the inside is hardware wire, hardware cloth, uh, half inch spacing. Uh, I bolted a feeder to the inside right here. Um, all in all, I'm extremely pleased with this. It's easy to pull. Um, I suppose a person you know, a 100, 120 pound person of ordinary strength could grab the rope on the far end and pull this thing around far enough to get it to a new spot of grass with the rabbits inside. Like I said, the next version will be um, a little bit thinner plywood and slightly lighter weight. All in all, I've been extraordinarily pleased with this project. And I'm going to make a few minor modifications, but basically, I think we have a great design here. I copied this design from the people that I'm getting the rabbits from. Well, I didn't copy it. They have a a rabbit tractor system that's very similar in dimensions, but it was built quite differently. And I took that for inspiration and made my own out of it.